So we have uh, some kind of a concert preparations going on on Italianska Ulitsa, where we're gonna walk, walk on, walk around on SPB Transport Fest. Ah, I know this Transport Fest. It's on 22nd. I think it's tomorrow, isn't it? I think so. We're gonna have uh, lots of cars and buses here. And I was actually, believe me or not, was gonna attend, but let's see the stuff to do. Let's head out to this awesome looking mini park on the side of Italianska. 1871, imagine that. We can we have a we have this park all to ourselves. Ivan Sergeyevich Turgenev Turgenev on Italianskaya Street. Looks pretty impressive. So what is this? Here's a building with a with a plate. Italianska 12. This dom was vidion in 2001. This house was built in 2001, uh, supported by Governor Yakovlev. Uh, Architect, yes. Uh, in the celebration of uh, St. Petersburg's 300 year celebration. Yes. All right. Let's head back to Italianska. This is going to be probably packed with uh, with cars and and such. And here's a building where. Uh, hold up. And I'm standing next to a building where uh, in a 1918 Lenin was supported here uh, Lenin was uh, standing on the uh, on a uh, what's that word for it uh, on the vehicle and having his speech for the for a crowd here in Italianska and here's the here's the building <laughs> Zimni Stadion, Winter Stadium, Stadium. So here's a festival of uh, transportation. So there's buses and uh, all kinds of bigger cars, retro cars, going to be uh, standing here, and uh, people are going to be able to see them. And experience the retro. I think it's uh, well. It's a celebration of a uh, of. Uh, I think oh, there's something going on already. We'll see. Let's check out first the. Uh, these are new buses, by the way. Here's the Saint Petersburg's uh, logo. And this is uh, what was the word for it? Mala. Manjezny Skvier, I think so. And the fountain is working. Last time I was here, I have a video out where I walk to Fantanka, to St. Michael's uh, 
set castle. This wasn't working yet. And here's the uh, statues or busts of different kinds of uh, architectures. Rastrelli is well known, for example, uh, of many works. I think Rastrelli might have been part of the St. Michael's Castle work, not sure. These are electric buses, by the way. Check it out. St. Petersburg. Nice. And here's a dog. <laughs> nice dog. St. Petersburg has uh, lots of dogs, actually. Uh, So, what I love about St. Petersburg is that uh, you just need to start walking and you find stuff. Like, what are the odds that I read about the St. Petersburg Transport uh, 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 Transport Fest and all of a sudden I hear what it's going to happen. People, uh, interesting characters uh, are met, uh, events happen, so it's because of the Russian, well, I call it the Russian factor also. <laughs> the Russian factor is always there. Let's see what we have here, some buses in line. Some VIPs. Oh, that's some coffee, all right. All right, these are cool looking buses. But when I started this film in this episode, I was not intending to make a video about buses, trust me. Volga bus. That's a Russian, Russian uh, brand. Historical buildings on both sides. And there you can see actually really cool looking uh, bronze. Uh, Peter the Great's statue and behind it St. Michael's castle which was built for uh, Paul the first who got to live there only for 40 days because before he was assassinated and the only reason why he was building that castle was to for uh, actually for protection so uh, that didn't work well he was uh, killed by his own guardsmen it's a lonely place as it been as emperor all right so these are here, but the, uh, the festival is going to be only later. Hey, I know this one, Lux Express. That's the bus if you want to travel from uh, Baltic states to Russia, St. Petersburg. That's the one to take. It's a really nice bus. Some interesting designs for buses. This is type of a bus that you can see on Hollywood, Beverly Hills probably. And here's a brand new. Oh, cool. Some effects. Here are some brand new uh, trams. St. Petersburg. This is awesome. somebody in already Blo blocked by a bus over there how cool is this gotta make some f photos all right Empty street is so peaceful. Continuing on. Beautiful architecture all around. Loving St. Petersburg. 
here's some uh, electrical uh, buses that we have here in St. Petersburg. Let's check them out. Really nice picture. <laughs> Wow, all shiny. So these are, what's the word for them? Uh, Trans Alifa, the buses which work on the, uh, well, from Soviet times, trolleys, no? Are, are they trolleys? There's a few of them, few designs in line, yes and beautiful St. Michael's castle behind it. It's raining, starting to rain heavier and heavier. Let's try to wrap this video up. Whoa. All you bus enthusiasts, you're welcome. So behind it is the uh, St. Petersburg's, uh, over there behind this tram, you can see the, uh, the circus. I wonder what's this? Not gonna use the QR code to find it, find out, but uh, here we can see a retro bus over here. Let's go there soon. Here's also a, a new tram for St. Petersburg. Really cool looking. Here's the circus and the road is cut off by a bus for safety reasons. This is cool looking tram I must say. All right, I think we're gonna try to head out to the retro bus and then stop this video there. This is a, I don't know, it looks like 60s type of bus. This is the retro section of the, uh, of the festival. They look all right. <sighs> Steering wheel, <laughs> really simple. RAF Riga, is it Riga? Riga production. Soviet Latvia. Here's some cool looking hippie stuff. All right, it's raining, it's raining so hard. Thanks for joining. This is Igor in Russia. Please subscribe, leave a comment. Facebooking Russia and here on YouTube also. That's Igor in Russia, and see you guys. Bye.